Hello. <clears throat> Hello, teacher. Hi, everyone. Everyone. Only four people are here. Hello. <laughs> How are you this evening? Everything good? Hi, teacher. Hi. Very good. All right. Okay. What about you? <laughs> I'm doing great. Thank you. Is your name Sophia? I can't remember. My name is Camila. Ah, Camila. You have the face of a Camila, yeah. But I want to change the name here. So it's Camila in your last name because it says Galaxy. <laughs> so ah, I'm, I'm connected from my my phone today. So it my, my last name is Balibrera. Oh, I cannot write that. Is that with a B as in boy? B, yeah, B-A-L-I-B-R-E-R-A. Okay, I'm just going to leave it as Camila B. It's going to take forever. Okay. <clears throat> All right, guys, uh, did you finish the platform? Lessons one and two? Hopefully. Yeah. Yes. All right, perfect. Well, last time we were practicing. <clears throat> yes, I finished. Uh, as a bonus, right? We were practicing the pronunciation of the past. So we're gonna play this game and please tell me how would you how you would pronounce the past of each verb. All of these are regular, okay? So how would you pronounce the past of cry? Cry with T. No. Right. Yeah, the last sound is cry cry. So it's E cry. it has vibration. E. E. So it's cry. It's so with me. I. Yeah, let's try another one. Hey, that's not what I thought. All right, hold on. Let me see. All right, hold on. Uh, well, yeah, we can do this one, I think. How would you pronounce the past of that? D. All right. All right. All right. With a D or T? All right. All right. right. With tea. With tea. Yes. With tea. Let's see another one. Okay. This one. Mm -hmm. Ed. Painted. Yes. With Painted. That it sound exactly. Painted. All right. Let's wait for another one. If it doesn't say game over, hopefully. All right, this one. Let's finish. It's two. ED. With D. No, listen. 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 Yes. It's with T. D. No D. vibration. D as in David. It does vibrate. Look. Mm. Listen. 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 Yes. It listen. has vibration. Listen. All right. <clears throat> this one. <laughs> Found. 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 D. D. Yes, perfect. <clears throat> what about this one? T. Attacked. That's a T, yes. Attacked. Attacked. Awesome. This one? Attacked. Well, wait. Saved. 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 D, as in David, right? Yeah. yeah. Because it's saved. It has a lot of vibration Save. on it. All right. We're going to do two Save. more and continue with the platform, okay? So pay attention. This one? Lived. 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 What is it? Lived. It can't be D because it, the verb in the base form would have to finish with a T or D sound. And this one ends with a V sound. Live. Do. It is lived. 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 All right. We can try this one now. Uh -huh. Started. 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 Yeah. Started. 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 Okay. Started. Good it's job, everyone. I, I think you're improving this now, right? Yeah. I think your pronunciation of this on this has been improving. That's awesome. All right. Perfect. 
Um, we're gonna practice this conversation, I think. If we haven't, let me see. Yeah, no, we haven't. All right. Can you read the objective, please? Uh, Roberto Donay. Okay. In this class, participants will listen and practice a conversation where people are catching up on news. Perfect. Let's listen. I don't see. Hello. This time we want you to listen to the following conversation. The idea is for you to understand what's going on and also to practice it with a friend or a relative. Once you do that, we want you to play the second part of the conversation and get ready to answer the question I have for you. What have you been doing? Part A. Listen and practice. Hey, Gina. I haven't seen you in ages. What have you been doing lately? Nothing exciting. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. How come? I'm saving up money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, it is. What about you? Well, I've only been spending money. I'm pursuing a full-time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduated, but I haven't been getting any work. I need a job soon. I'm almost out of money. What has happened to Pete and Gina since they last saw each other? Please write your answer on What have you been doing? Once you do that, we want you to play the second part of the conversation and get ready to answer the question I have for you. What have you been doing? Okay, we're going to practice the pronunciation of this dialogue on mute and everybody repeating at the same time. Ready? Okay. Go. Part A. Listen and practice. Hey, Gina. I haven't seen you in ages. Hey, Gina. I haven't seen you in ages. Okay, everybody on mute, and we're gonna try to imitate the intonation too and the, the intention. All right, so you're gonna say, Hey, Gina, I haven't seen you in ages because that intonation conveys meaning too. All right, so try to imitate them and speak like, like they do because they speak like this. All right, next part. What have you been doing lately? Nothing exciting. Nothing exciting. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. How come? I'm saving up money for a trip to Morocco. I'm saving my money for a trip to Mor Morocco. Wow, that's exciting. Wow, that's exciting. Okay, everybody repeat on mute. <clears throat> yeah, it is. What about you? What? Yeah, it is. What about you? Well, I've only been spending money. Oh. I been I only been spending money. I'm pursuing a full time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduated. Listen how he says, since I graduated. Did you hear that? Since I graduated. Ju. Okay. But I haven't been getting any work. I need a job soon. I'm almost out of money. Okay. Well done. I imagine you did a great job, but no idea. 
All right, so uh, this part we don't need to listen to, but I want you to know, I, well, I want you to tell me, where can you see present perfect in the conversation or present perfect continuous, if you remember? Now you can unmute the microphones if you would like to. I haven't seen you in age is uh, uh, present perfect. Yes, I haven't seen you in ages. I haven't seen you in ages. All right, perfect. That is present perfect. What else? What have you been doing lately? Yes, present perfect. Continuous. Yeah, continuous. What else? I've I'm been working. working. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. What else? I'm saving up money I'm for saving a trip. Money for a trip. No, that would be present no, 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 only. No. I've only been I'm spending been money. money. I've only two. been, where is, I've only sure. been here. Uh -huh. Yes, yeah, the money. present is perfect, continuous. How long uh, have you how been, long been, have you been modeling? modeling? How long have yeah. you been no modeling? modeling. 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 Remember, I haven't been eating thing. any work. <laughs> Any work. That's I have been any, any, any work. Yes, yes, we have many examples here. All right. So what we're gonna do now is two things. Now I will have the opportunity to see whether or not you were pronouncing correctly. Okay. Right. Okay. I can't find any guys. I mentioned this part. Let me see. You do. You do graduate since I graduated. Right. This part. This. Did you notice the pronunciation of this? Since we it was graduated. Yeah. Graduated. Yeah. Yeah. graduated. Okay, graduated. the pronunciation yeah. is like manager. Since I graduated. Manager. You pronounce this manager, right? And graduated to gra. This is going to be ju. Graduated. Like manager, the same sound, the ju, 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 ju sound. You. All right, so when you say, for example, a let me see, pro C. Same thing happens here. It's proceed, procedure. 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 Yes, procedure. the majority, procedure. The majority of do are gonna be pronounced ju, okay? Ju, mm -hmm. procedure. Yes. How be about, silent. How about this one? Education. A, 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 a ju, a, a, like manager, a, a ju, education. A, education. 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 Yes. The yeah. silent teacher. It's not silent. It sounds like j from manager. G, d, g, uh. So in a comula, j, the manager. Okay. Ah, okay. With a lot of vibration on it. Manager. Education in education. Eruno edu. That's the thing. E education. All right. Education. Ra education. Ra education. Graduated. Graduated. In manager, right? Manager. So manager. this is what manager. I'm telling you guys. Graduated. The majority of do are going to be pronounced yeah. do. Manager. That is the right pronunciation. Oh, for example, this word? This is? Schedule. 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 And we have more, but I can't remember and I couldn't find anything. But that's another uh, pronunciation to check. Right. Now, what we're going to do, yes? May I? Uh, because uh, the sound, I, I suppose, is with like a Y, uh, not with LL, because LL in Spanish is LG. Oh, but that is the name. The sound of, for example, pollo. It's similar because the, the phonetic symbol for j is like this. Oh, the thing no. is, it's, it's so complicated. All right. But the phonetic okay. symbol is like this. Esa es la letra que representa ese sonido. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> yeah. But I mean, okay. difficult, right? Mejor te lo pongo como j. Because yeah. <laughs> supposedly we have yo, yo, right? And then we have, so yo. at some point they use, I remember, Solían enseñar que era más fuerte la, la L, right? pero ya yeah. no, o sea. Y que era po yo. Yo. Bueno, en inglés no es como el yo, es, es como el yo. Con mucha vibración. Po yo. Po Si dijéramos po yo en inglés, diríamos po yo. 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 Con vibración. Okay. That's the sound. 
represented by this phonetic symbol. All right. Anyway, uh, yeah. Let's see. This dialogue, we're going to practice it, okay? In, okay? in pairs. And let me send it to the group. All right. After you practice it the way it is, without modifying it, you're going to modify the dialogue in, in a different situation, okay? For example, imagine I'm practicing with, with Jacqueline. And I say, and I say, hey, Jacqueline, I haven't seen you in ages. What have you been doing lately? And try to say something real, all right? I don't know, maybe Jacqueline has been studying English. She has been working in, a, where do you work, Jacqueline? I have a little business, teacher. Oh, you have your own business, okay. What yeah. is it? What kind uh, of business the do you food, have? The food. Oh, nice. Okay, so she can yes, say, for example, I, I have food. been, I have been um, working on my own business. All right. Is that clear? First round. The first round, la primera ronda es tal cual está. Uh, for example, imagine I'm working with Jacqueline. Jacqueline sería Pete y yo Gina. Luego yo sería Gina y ella sería Pete. O dije lo mismo, no me acuerdo. <ríe> bueno, cambiamos. <ríe> Creo que dije lo mismo. Eh, y después de haber practicado tal cual, lo modificamos con información um, posible o, en lo, en lo real. que cabe. Real. Uh -huh. All right. Ready? Okay. Yeah. Ready I think here. so. <ríe> Ready or not, here we go. Okay. <ríe> All right, accept the invitation, please. Here we go. Accept the invitation, please. Ailey, Joaquin, Daniel. Daniel. Uh, I share the screen. Lady? Nothing exciting. I have been working. Hello, guys. Hello. Diego and Ailey, are you there? Good evening, Jesus. I started? Who, who is watching TV? Because we can hear it very loudly. So, All right, that's better. Thank you. Yeah. Sorry. All right. Okay, I started. Hello, guys. I have money for a trip, for a trip to Morocco. Well, that is exciting. Yeah, it is. What about you? Well, I will only be spending money. I'm Jobson. I'm almost, I'm almost out of money. Okay. okay. Right now, uh, you you will say something real from your life. Okay. Okay. Hey, Dina, I haven't seen you in ages. What have you been doing lately? Nothing, Epsi. I have been working two jobs for the labs this month. How come? I am I'm saving up money for a trip to Morocco. Um, <laughs> no, you, you can save me. That's exciting. Yeah, 
It is, what about you? Well, I've only been spending money. I'm pursuing a full-time model in Scaris. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduate, graduated, uh, but I haven't been getting any work. I need a job soon. I'm almost out of money. Okay. Um, uh, right yeah. now, this uh, information, the information of us. I'm peeling again. Hi, Gina. I have. You are Wendy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You yeah, first. Uh -huh. Okay. Hey, hey, Wendy. Have you been seeing you in age? What have you been doing lately? Lately? Hi, Joaquin. Oh, I've been very busy last year. I'm, I got married last year. Wow. How come? Okay. It, it was exciting, but it was a stressful too. Oh, that's nice. And what kind of, of job would you like to have? I I working um, in social job, social work, social work. I mean, social work. Yeah. In in the hospital. In a hospital. Oh, you in want a hospital. Uh -huh. You want to, to work uh, in in a in a social social, social work? work in a hospital in a hospital ah, a national hospital. hospital or a private hospital uh, yes in a, in in a house in, in a national hospital or a in a in a private one in un nacional or in un privado uh, national ah in a, in a national hospital. Oh. Oh, oh, prepare, privacy. Uh, private. Oh, private, okay. Oh, good, that's nice. And well, and ha what have you been doing during these two months ago? Um, durante dos, hace dos meses. Um, I have, uh, um, I have in, the vacation. You have been on vacation. I, I've been uh, have in vacation in okay. on vacation in the Cameroon. Oh, in the Cameroon. <laughs> in the Cameroon, yeah, in Sonsonate. In Sonsonate, the Cameroon. Oh, let's see, let's see. Oh, in yes, yes, you're right. In Sonsonate. Uh -huh. it, no, it is no, no, in Sonsonate. In is next to. Welcome back. How was the practice? Good. Was 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 good. Yeah, it was good. All right. Did you finish? Yeah. Yes. yes. The majority. Yes. All right. Awesome. Perfect. All right. Now we're going to start working with present perfect continuous. Okay. And can you read the objective, please, Jancy? Okay. By the end of this class, participants will understand, use, and practice the present perfect continuum. Awesome. Right. Let's watch. Here we go. Hi, we want you to go back to the previous conversation. Can you find examples of the statements with have and haven't been? Now, we want you to stay for the explanation of the structure and use of the present perfect continuous. 
Present Perfect Continuous. Use the Present Perfect Continuous for actions that start in the past and continue into the present. What have you been doing lately? I've been working two jobs for the last six months. How long have you been modeling? I've been modeling since I graduated. Have you been saving money? No, I haven't been saving any money. Something I want to highlight here is that um, if you notice, when we talk about duration, we're going to say how long, not how much time. Okay, how long Yeah. for time. And what is the structure of the affirmative form of the present perfect continuous? What's the structure? Subject plus mm -hmm. have or has. Yes. Plus been. Uh -huh. Plus been. Plus verb plus ing. The verb ending in ing. Exactly. Plus Company. So if you notice, if this is easier than present perfect, because in the present perfect, you have to use irregular verbs. And in this case, you don't need irregular verbs, only the auxiliary in bin, and then the verb in ing. It's easier, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. A question, teacher? Yes. Uh, what is the difference to use a present perfect or present perfect continuous? Two, two times? Uh, yeah, times. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, has the same meaning when um, I try to use? Yes, no, they're slightly different. Okay, but because uh, mm -hmm. above have the, the the same meaning. For example, use the the action to start in the past and continue in the present. Yeah, the thing is that okay, in a way, there are very few differences here. Yeah. Okay. All right, but. Most importantly, mm -hmm. present perfect continuous gives you an idea of a constant situation. All right. So yeah. imagine, even in the same thing happens in Spanish. If I say, eh, he trabajado uh -huh. desde ayer, I don't know, or he estado trabajando desde ayer. If you notice, the second one gives you or highlights the progress in how yeah, constant yeah, yeah. it yeah. is. Right. So it gives uh, you an idea of, of uh huh. When is a routine? It is when you express a routine, you use the the present perfect continuous or or no? No, present perfect no. continuous is for an action that started in the past, like you said it, and continues okay. in the present, and it may continue in the future because it's not over, so it goes from everywhere, like. For instance, this is the present, right? That's the past, and this is the future. What is the so, difference between past, uh, past continuous and past perfect continuous? Is the same or that is his question. the difference? <laughs> there are very <laughs> few differences. All right. So it, hap it, it happens here, and there's a possibility for the future. Okay. Like in your case, you can say, I have studied. Mm -hmm. Since uh, 2021, imagine. Since yeah, last yeah, yeah. Right, or I have been studying, studying. since 2021. So the only difference between the two of them is that this one seems more progressive, like more constant than this one, right? And a little bit, not really. In these cases, they mean exactly the same, but you get the impression that it's been more constant. So it's like yeah. saying, he estudiado y he estado estudiando, like constantly, right? Oh, yeah, I got But it. it's, I got it's it. a very small difference. Yeah. It's almost inexistent. Pero si okay. quisiera dar el mismo significado, lo podría usar en ambos. You can use it in both cases, yes. Oh, okay, okay, okay. But here's the thing. Here's the tricky part. And yeah. I don't think we have time to see all the differences because <laughs> you already know how to use this in Spanish, right? It's exactly the same thing in English. If, when you decide okay. to say, he estado haciendo esto in Spanish, it's going to be the same in English than he hecho okay. esto. It's the same, but we cannot go into much detail. But here it is. Let me see, for example, present. And I will send you this. If you're really interested, you can read this quickly, okay? Okay. Present perfect. Continuous versus present perfect here. Look. 
Mm -hmm. Let me see. Aula learn no no. All right, I will send you this article because it explains. Okay, okay, teacher. Text, um, it explains the difference. One of the main differences is when you can see the results of something, mm -hmm. you're supposed to use present perfect continue. So imagine, imagine you go in a room, okay, which messy kitchen. All right, imagine you go into a room that looks like mm -hmm. this. Uh, <laughs> like this. So messy. Or, or this. All right. <laughs> This is better to give you an idea. When the men cook. <laughs> when men cook. Yeah. <laughs> Miguel is like, yeah, true. <laughs> That's my kitchen sometimes. <laughs> All right. So if you can see evidence of something, it's better for you to use present perfect continuous because mm -hmm. you can say, alguien ha estado cocinando. Yeah. 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 Clearly, and it's obvious somebody has been cooking. So that's yeah. one of the differences when you can see evidence or if you see this, for example, I don't know, rain and the floor. If you go outside and you look and you look at the, at the floor yeah. and it looks like this, you can say it has been raining hasta lloviendo mm -hmm. because you can see evidence of that. In that case, yeah. it's better to use present perfect continuous. This okay. is the explanation. Look, it's kind of long. One, two, three, four, four differences. Okay. Okay. One exercise. Okay. So I'm going to send you the explanation okay. and the exercise if you want to okay. learn the difference. If not, okay. If not, base your decisions on Spanish. Okay. Ah, okay. Okay. But if you want to study, I will send you the link and the exercise. Is that, is that good? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. I think some of you are interested in knowing the difference, right? Yeah. Okay, well, we'll see. Yeah, very good. Now, um, hold on. All right, let's continue watching. I've been spending it. Moving on. Present perfect continuous is a tense used for. A continuous or repeated activity that began in the past and continues into the present. It emphasizes the activity itself and its duration. Let's look at these examples. Jack has been waiting for over an hour. I've been studying since three o'clock. How long have you been studying French? And last but not least, we'll go over the structure of these tense. For affirmative, this is what we use. I, we, you, they, plus have been, plus verb, plus ing. He, she, it, plus has been, plus verb, plus ing. When in negative, we need to add the word not between have or has and been. And as always, in questions, the helping verb or the auxiliary goes at the beginning, followed by the subject, like this. Have, plus subject, plus been, plus verb, plus ing plus complement. Have you been saving money? Can you now work on the following exercises? How long have you been learning English? Why are you tired? What have you been doing? What have you been eating? <laughs> the way they question you, right? <laughs> And what have you been doing? <laughs> what have you been eating? <laughs> like a kid. All right. So I, I'm interested. How would you answer this question? Imagine if I ask, uh, let me see who, Rosa Maria del Milagro Perez. Okay. How would you answer this question, Rosa, Rosemary? <laughs> if I say, I, why are you tired? It appears. What is the meaning of title? Tired means cansado. Mm, I'm working. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What are, why are you tired? What have you been doing? I have been working. I have, I have been working. working. Yes, okay. that would be the answer using the structure. Okay, so for your conversation, guys, I want you to use the structure. Okay, if you use the structure, it's not going to get difficult. All right, let's do this exercise together. 
if you have any questions, ask the questions right now because we're gonna go to the speaking part and you have to implement everything you have learned. All right, so number, letter A, what is it? What have? What? What, what have, 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 been, have, been, what have been you been doing? Been doing. 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 Nice. Well, I have. I have. I have, I have, I have been, been spending. I've been spending. I have been spending. I have been spending. I have been spending. Been spending. Okay. Have you worked? Have you, have you been working? Have you, have you been working? Been working. Been working. Have you been working? Yes. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. I have been making. I have been making. Drink, Yes, I have. Yes, I have. I have been making. You should too. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I have. Control de oh. Guys, somebody's saying al control de inventory, okay? You know that person <laughs> is, so please. <laughs> please mute the microphone. Right, How have you. you been? Have you? Okay, they're probably have you been feeling? How have you been feeling? How have you been feeling? Feeling. Awesome. Great. Great. I. I've been getting. I've been getting. Getting. And I haven't been eating. Hasn't. Haven't. Haven't been eating. Haven't been eating. Haven't been eating. Haven't been eating. All right. Hasn't or has is going to be for, you know, right? For he, she, it. Yeah. And have for well, the other four. Yes. They win that. You. Awesome. Next. Have, have you have you been getting lady? Awesome. No, I have I haven't. haven't. I haven't. I haven't. I have I've been, been studying. Been studying. Been studying. No. <laughs> no, 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 next. No, the last, 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 the last, the last. Last. Yeah, the spelling of this one is right. Let's see. Oh, good. All right. Now we're gonna practice some speaking. Here are the questions. We have a lot that we can practice, all right? So as you saw in the video, this makes emphasis on the duration and the constancy with which you have been doing this, all right? So we're gonna discuss in small groups of three. I will send you the link, all right? So that you can open it. And do you have any questions? No? Here it is. On the on the chat, but I will send it to WhatsApp too. We're gonna work in groups of three. Here we go. Hold on. Let me see. Oh, bike. Breakout rooms. There it is. Accept the invitation, please. And let's practice. Roberto and Daniel. Okay, we okay. We need resolve this question. What the questions? Okay. Do you see my screen? Yes, I can okay. just. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. So we're going to discuss okay. the questions, have a conversation. Yes. Well, what, what we are going to do is to answer the question, teacher. Yeah, it's yes. a speaking activity. Oh. Mm -hmm. How have you been feeling the. 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 Lately? Okay. 
Okay. How have you been feeling lately, Roberto? I have been, been tired lately. I have been feeling tired. Oh, I have been feeling tired what lately. What do you use? Uh -huh. And the second, how have you been getting to work? Okay. Okay, the next Working. one. How have you been getting? The next one. Uh, Joaquin. Okay. Let's ask me. Or here on the chat. Yeah. In the chat oh. coming. Not only on WhatsApp. Or read the question in WhatsApp group, guys. Yeah. Who's it's so easy. Crazy is Arturo. Arturo, Arturo. Okay. What's the first question, Osman? Uh, I, I, in this moment, I, I see you. I see the, the, the WhatsApp group. I yeah. read the question, guys. Uh, open Number the one. Link. How have you been feeling lately? Ah, okay. Um, how have you been? How have you been feeling lately? Lately, okay. Lately. The question number 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 one. Yeah. And I'm 23 years old, and I'm so happy for that. Oh, congratulations! Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Number two, um, how have oh. you been getting to work or school recently? Roberto? Ro Roberto is out. He's out, maybe. Okay. Okay, good. Um, good. Uh, <laughs> I, I go uh, doing some things in by, by car, by my own car. And what about you, Marjorie? Um... I have been uh, a work to work. You go to work to work in by to work in uh, uh by baby city. Ah, the baby city. No, no, no. But yes. how is the mean you used to go working? ¿Cuál es el medio que usted ocupa para ir a trabajar? Oh, <laughs> have you been getting to work? Okay, uh, by bus. Ah, by bus. That's nice. <laughs> May I read the number three, please? Okay, and uh, what have May you been it? thinking about a lot? What have you been thinking about a lot? Um, I have been thinking. I have been thinking. Oh, <laughs> Roberto. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Continue. Have... Continue. I have a problem with my, my internet. And you, Daniel? What have you been dreaming about? <laughs> I, don't, I don't remember. Uh, I, I think I have been dreaming in, in to travel. Okay, and number six or seven? Six. 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 Okay. Well, what have you been waiting to sell some? I don't remember. What is say uh, the pronunciation? Lady. Number six. Lately. Late. Lately. Lately. Yes. Okay. What have you been waiting to tell someone lately? Because uh, I I was I I I need a haircut. I needed a haircut. Well, I was thinking about that. Holiday. 
in a new haircut. Yeah. That's nice. Okay, so only good things. <laughs> yes. Okay, next one. What have you been doing this week, Joaquin? Um I I have been um doing my homework on the on platform. Nice. My work my homework in platform. I have been doing my homework in platform That's good. Yeah. English. Or the okay. English. Yeah. What is the, in this case, what is the mean about a lot? Se ha estado pensando mucho. Mucho. Ah, I think Acerca de qué? Okay. Okay. In your case, I read for you. What have you been thinking about a lot? I about money. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, I, I think uh, everybody think about the money. Yeah. Oh. Use the use the structure. <laughs> but in, in my in my case, uh, I have been thinking about my job. Okay. Okay. ¿Cuánto tiempo ha estado usted trabajando en el mismo campo? I start I have with been? my I have been work since three months ago. Oh, three months oh, ago. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a little, a little, uh, little. Uh, Is it in San Salvador? I live in, in Armenia, Sosonate. Armenia. Oh. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Continue with five the number five, maybe. Number five. Or four. Number five. What have you been dreaming about lately? About lately. 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 I have been dreaming about changing house. And you, mean? Roberto? Uh, what does that mean? Dreaming. Como Dreaming. Soñar. Soñar. Soñando. Soñar. Ah, okay. Soñando. I have dreaming. I have been dreaming. In, in lear, lear, learning. Learning uh -huh. English. Oh. Mucho más. Uh -huh. Very much. <laughs> yes. Better. Better. And, better. Okay. And you? And you, Marjorie? Um, I have uh, been dreaming uh, finish the course. Yes, me too. <laughs> yes. Uh, and is there a other? Yes. Other course? I think uh, um uh excel mm. next next course will be uh, uh white color white okay uh, in my case i i have been wearing uh blue and red color lately in my case i have been wearing black and white. Okay. 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 It's, it's very, it's very easy. It's very easy. Uh, tranquilo. Okay. Uh, it's very Relax. Easy. You say nice. it's very quiet. Relaxing. Quiet. Very quiet. Very okay. quiet. Mm -hmm. Very quiet. Uh, in my case, I, I, I was there uh, for, for Joe. That's nice. Joaquin is a romantic husband. 
What about you? What about you? Uh, what have you? What have you been waiting to tell somebody lately? Maybe I have. I wa. I don't know. This is difficult one. Okay. I want to to tell somebody, someone. Well, I think that sometimes you miss to say the people that you love how much they care. So maybe I I have I have been going for my pace on quiet in my room. Okay, in my case I have been going for space and quiet in my in my home and my church. Let's wait for everyone. How was that speaking practice? Interesting? Not really? <laughs> yes, it was, was funny. It, it was okay. funny, yeah. It was, it was really funny. <laughs> nice. Yeah, we can, we can do speaking Sorry. every day. But guys, it was fun. Fun is divertido. Y funny, gracioso. Oh, the both. Mm. It was both. <laughs> Miguel, <laughs> funny and fun. Okay, I'm yeah. glad you enjoyed it. But yeah, for example, if you go to the mountains, is it fun or funny? It's fun. Fun. If you watch fun. a comedy, is it fun or funny? It's fun. Funny. 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 Uh -huh. Okay, that's the difference. Very good. Do you have any questions? Well, teacher, uh... In the platform, uh, we, I have been working in. This is in the uh, uh -huh. And it is very, very difficult because I, I have used the, the, the tense as they, the, as they say, but the responses, the replies are wrong. Yeah, the answers are wrong. Yeah, but that is a problem with the platform. So um, I don't know the name of this person that is supposed to help you with the answers because uh, well in last okay, last mm -hmm. in last course it was miss miss iglesias mm -mm. no i don't think it's the same one who is Others. it now guys no i don't know Nancy. 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 i don't remember i don't remember she has fernanda cordova i think oh fernanda cordova yes <laughs> Okay. Sorry, Paola Iglesias, maybe? Uh -huh. Paola maybe, Iglesias. Maybe she's in charge of your group. I don't know. But try to uh -huh. find uh, throughout the chat. Carla there. Rodriguez, dice. Carla Rodriguez is la que está encargada esta vez de la plataforma. Carla. Okay. okay. Yeah, it is in the chat. And they say, hey, if you yeah, need any help, la, la, la. All right, <laughs> contact that person and ask for the answers. And if you have the answers, if somebody struggled getting the answers and you find them, please share them with the group. That's easier so that not everybody has to contact Carla. 20 people say, hey, give me the answers, right? Si alguien se da cuenta que le costó y fue a preguntar y las consiguió, compártelas. Okay? Porque todos van a tener el mismo problema. Everybody's going to have the yes. same issues. Teachers. Okay. I finish. I, finish I agree lesson. with you, teacher. Yes. I finished lesson two. Oh, wow. I don't know. It's necessary that was you Friday. Receive. Yeah, I need okay. to receive the class, then to continue resolve the next lesson. No, you can finish it now if you want to. That would be better for you. So ah, okay, be okay, ahead. Okay, okay, okay. okay. All right, thank you guys. Have a nice night. Thank, thank you, you. Thank 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 you. Thank